covering Mike Kosicki because he's been matchup problem for mm -hmm. a lot of linebackers. Yeah. Just a big time this year. Um, I mean, I, I think our coach has done a great job of uh, like coaching us up based on that. Um, I understand he's, you know, they got some good athletic players on their team. Um, guys who run well and, you know, are absolute great receivers catching the ball. Um, but as far as that, you know, we're going to just play team defense, you know, do what we do best, communicate, um, make sure we make the right plays, make the right calls, and, uh, you know, always be on point in our communication. I mean, commu as far as, like, communication, understanding where people are during the play, um, like what we see, what we understand, if we see something, call it out. You know, it all goes into the game plan. You know, we definitely do a great job of, like, practicing and understanding what we're going to do in practice. And uh, it's all about executing on the field. So as long as we play good team defense, communicate, I think we can get the job done. How do you say sharp tackling when you have a mm -hmm. game in a month? Like, you know, sometimes yeah. you struggle like the first game of the year and it kind of carries in the whole game sometimes. You got to practice it. Um, definitely, uh, you know, a lot of guys don't want to go into practice like live tackling, but throughout the weeks, you know, we definitely kept the shoulder pads on and the thigh pads on, and we stay true to what we do. You know, uh, we run the same drills we've been running all year. Um, we might have done a little more than what we've been doing all year, but it's preparation time, you know. So throughout the few weeks, you know, we make sure we've been preparing as hard as possible, doing our drills as hard as possible, and just just getting them mental reps, you know. So we don't really want to hurt guys, you know, bowl practice and you know, live tackling, but we definitely make sure our drills are like high tempo, high energy, like very focused. And I think our coaches do a great job of like preparing us for tackling. How important are Vita and Greg? You guys run defense because they seem to win so much you know, up front. <clears throat> um, they're very important. I mean, they're the center of our defense. You know, uh, you know, they really are the base of our defense. So, you know, as long as, you know, they're taking two and making uh, open, uh, openings for other guys to, you know, run through and get, make some plays, um, I mean, it starts with them, honestly. So uh, they're very important. They're very important. How would you compare and contrast it from Mark and Bryce Love's runners? Just different yeah. styles. Um, seem to be the two top backs this year. You know, they, they do have uh, very different styles, but they're similar playmakers. Um, Saquon, uh, you know, he'll, he'll show like an inside run, it'll be an inside run, and he'll just make something happen, boom, bounce outside, 30 yards, touchdown. Um, Bryce is love is a similar way, but he's more like inside, consistently inside, inside, pounding the rock, five yards, three yards, you know, like two yards, and keep going right back to that. I mean, they do have very, I want to say it's very similar, but uh, I would say Saquon is a little more elusive, and Bryce Love is like kind of more just pounding the rock.